Dahlias are indigenous to the high plateau area of Mexico. They began to be grown in American gardens in the late 1700s and early 1800s. These beauties were largely developed as a result of traditional breeding programs in Europe during the 1800s. This beauty in the afternoon sunlight is Prince of Orange. Both of these blossoms are Cafe au lait. You can see sometimes it's a beigey white and sometimes it's this glorious pink. It really is a beautiful dahlia. And this beauty is one of the most famous of all dahlias. This is the Bishop of Landoff, introduced in 1929. It is one of the most consistent bloomers that we have in the dahlia kingdom. And the red, no photograph, and I doubt this video will be able to capture just how beautiful the red is in this beautiful dahlia, Bishop of Landa. This beauty is called Sunshine. Besides having this gorgeous single blossom, single petal layer blossom, it also has this exquisite foliage. Look at the color. It's absolutely black. This is the decorative dahlia seduction. This giant is Tom Salk. It's very unreliable in terms of color. This year it's red. Some years it's more orange. Some years it's more orangey red. And some years it's almost a pinkish brown. Interesting dahlia. This beauty is the decorative dahlia Jowie Gypsy. No other flower, and I include chrysanthemums in this, celebrate fall and are more joyous when the fall comes than dahlias. We are so incredibly lucky to have these beautiful plants. So remember this absolutely beautiful garden. And these glorious flowers. Because this is what you get. This. This is what you get. in the fall with dahlias. They go on and on. Look at this giant one. these beauties. Okay. Remember harvesting history because we have one of the largest collections of dahlias in the country. And if you're interested Come visit us in December or early spring and make an order. This is why you raise dahlias.